This one's for YouTube user HDXFH. Uh, you asked me which parts of this power hacksaw were washing machine. And basically, there is an awful lot of washing machine in it, but this whole worm drive control gear motor is from the original washing machine. Obviously a British Thompson Houston. Unfortunately, I lost a bit of the enamel off this badge as I was trying to remove it before painting. It was rather pristine before I did that, unfortunately, but that's just how it goes. Uh, this is the ringer drive up here. This shaft actually used to extend all the way up to the top of the machine to drive the ringer. That's why it's running at such low speed but very high torque. All the gears and things have been removed from this part of the gearbox and it's blanked off. It's got wooden plugs and basically just an empty casting down the bottom. The motor, I believe, is a London-made GEC machines or something, maybe one-eighth horsepower at the most. It's the same as the uh, small motor on the cool blue lights. It uses... Uh, easy washing machine or whichever one that is. I think it is the Easy brand washing machine. Now the other main washing machine part is the cabinet itself. That's the bottom side of the cabinet. You'd have cast iron mounts for the little caster wheels there and there. Obviously up here and here, the whole thing's just been cut down and oxy-torched and bent and bronze welded into shape. Whoever built this thing had a hell of a lot of time on their hands and a lot of skill in cutting and welding and bronzing. There's actually very little arc welding done on this. Well, most of it's bronze weld. I've fully restored it myself. Uh, it came to me just as a junk I paid 30 bucks for it and it was a mothballed piece of crap basically covered in dirt didn't work I've replaced all the cabling got everything working again then got a cutout switch on it this is the original on off switch got it plugged in at the moment so it'll start dampener here used to be a I think it's a flap control cylinder for a large aircraft probably a military aircraft somebody suggested maybe a uh, Hercules or something it's made by Sperry Gyroscope Company Brooklyn New York Got more data on the other side the hydraulic surface control for type A3 automatic pilot Air Forces US Army spec number 27981 there's no order number on it but the serial number is 69817 if that's of any use to anyone so far I haven't found any info on it it's been heavily modified they've chopped the screw fitting for the hydraulics off and plugged all these holes up taken something off the end here and made a custom made end plate and a uh, flow regulator they basically turned it into a damper instead of a hydraulic cylinder so it's useless as its original form but the bulk of it's still there yeah, the part number is 645218 I found a very old patent document on it but there was very little info in it obviously very old all this gearbox is the original washing machine and this heavily modified and cut and shut cabinet is washing machine that's about it
the rest of this is all scrap metal and spare parts all these little felt wipers are handmade all this stuff somebody spent a lot of time building this thing all this is uh, bronze welded it's not arc or MIG welded that block there is made out of wood they've remounted and relocated this whole gearbox actually very quiet and rather efficient when it runs as a hacksaw anyway. I'm going to finish trimming these off and readjust this end here. It tends to wobble around a little bit. But apart from that this thing is just a work of art. <laughs> 